Right, look what's coming into focus, folks. I'm on one of these gorgeous English droves. Like I said, I could walk all over the country with these. I love them. Real old English droves. Beautiful. And there we come. The Bosington Beacon ahead of me. I've got to get over there yet. Not right onto the beacon, but quite close. This is a mammoth walk. I tend to forget how big it was. I did the extra. But I didn't walk there and, and have to walk back. God, no way. I learned a little bit from when I did that massive walk last two years ago. God, that was gorgeous, really. But I had to rush it because um, it was getting dark. It was dark by 8 o'clock then. I don't know if I'll be able to get anything to eat, and these places all shut up. There might be fish and chips. I can't, I can't remember, really. All I know is Jude and Stuart used to like going there. Poor lot where. Jude's loved it all her life. And her death, probably. Could be. I don't really know. All I know is that this farm is taking forever to come. But I do know... Once I do reach the farm, Coldbone isn't far. I know that. So bear with me, everyone. I won't go on too long because I think you all get bored. Um, I, don't, I just mentioned a brief event. I, I haven't listened to news for two days, so I, I'm probably out of date now. Boris Johnson is uh, just standing in as a guardian while they've elect a new successor to his leadership. Some say he should go right away because that's why they want him out. And for him to drag it out till October is not right. Others want him to stay. So, you know, it's um, it's very difficult really how they've uh, hounded him out so quickly when they were all supporting everything he was doing. That's what I can't believe. It's the same. It's his own party that are doing it to him. I've got a long walk home after this, you know. Oh. But I'm going to have a rest in Porlock Weir. I'm going to have a rest at Colbone. I'm going to have a small rest at Colbone. And it seems like last year I was over at Colbone actually. Um, I'm just plodding. Just plodding. It's funny how I, how I thought um, this next farm was a lot, lot, lot closer. A lot closer. But of course, if I had been allowed to go up that coombe earlier, I would have been over here quicker because I would have been able to cross that road further down. So they probably put on, it could be 20 minutes, half an hour on my time by that. I was like to climb over a barbed wire fence. Glad I did do that. Found, I'm glad I found that gate. Glad I never started walking back towards County Gate. So that would have really been a massive, although we weren't far from it, to be quite honest. Right, I'm going to just turn around a minute. Yeah. Anyone who does this hike, they know it's big. But they might have had the students out doing it. We might have done. I'm walking on the grass, it's slightly softer. Oh. 
shaking his butt. That woman didn't look like that. She sounded like him as well. And she took swimming in the sea and all that. Hi, oh, yeah, yes, but if you're tall, you can see everything. <laughs> of course, when, um, I think when I was here before, it had all died down quite a lot, so I could see over. But there are little gaps now and again where I can have a, look, like a little look. I can lift the camera up, see? Right, going on, I'm just turning off again. Some darlings. I'll leave those two there then. It's all right. You're doing your guard duty. I'm so frightened. It's all right. Come on. Come on. Do you want a biscuit? Come on. Look. Good boy. Good boy. There we are. Miss Minis. Miss Minis. Yeah, you want one? You'll have one, won't you? It's only a biscuit. Look. Yeah. There we go. All right. Pardon? No. No, I'm walking. Come on. Come on. Look. Look. Yeah. 